Hi Cancer, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Cancer, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Cancer. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Two of Cups, and this is Water Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio Energy. So this is an energy of mutual love and affection. This is connecting with your counterpart. So this is someone who the feelings are mutual. There's a genuine love and affection here. So let's see what the rest of the cards have to say. We have the Ace of Swords, Air Energy. We have the Four of Cups, Water Energy. And we have the seven of pentacles, earth energy. So yeah, it looks like you and someone are having an opportunity to see a breakthrough in your love. Um, with the seven of pentacles, this could have been a slow to start connection. It's almost like someone couldn't really, it's, one person took a bit longer to recognize the connection with the four of cups being here. But there's this realization that there's something more here. So this could be something that was moving gradually, very slowly, almost like you guys were friends before or you knew of each other, but there was no um, action taken on the romantic side of the connection. And it's like this breakthrough moment happening here where you guys are seeing a new beginning or there could be a confession of feelings that leads to this two of cups type of love. So let's clarify these cards, Cancer. Okay, so we have the Knight of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So yeah, it looks like someone moved very slowly, or this connection was just very slow to develop. Um, but there's an energy of potential for something long-term and secure here. Yeah. So let's see. We have the Emperor, Aries Energy, the Ten of Swords, Air Energy, and the Queen of Wands, Fire Energy. So there's a change happening. The way you guys once knew this relationship to be or this connection is transforming. There's an energy of it becoming more serious. Um, one or both of you are making that decision to take this more seriously. And you guys could have that talk, you know, because we're seeing an energy of wanting to, you know, solidify the connection, wanting to stabilize the connection in some way. And with the Queen of Wands, this person is recognizing a genuine passion and desire. Um, so it's like the awakening, awakening to the connection itself in a more romantic way. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Cancel. Okay, we have your hard work is paying off. New moon in Capricorn. Okay. 
Okay, we have trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. Okay, we have strength of character and moral integrity. Character cannot be developed in ease and quiet. Only through experiences of trial and suffering can the soul be strengthened, vision cleared, ambition inspired, and success achieved. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Cancer. Okay, we have surrender, low self-esteem. You deserve success, love, and abundance. Set an intention to identify and release any remnants of low self-esteem. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, Cancer. I hope you have a really, really good day, Cancer. Bye, Cancer.